Hello, I'm Jane. Welcome to the FAZ group. Come on in and see what we're doing. See what we're doing to help you. Thank you. The centre is for people with aphasia. Are you well today? I'm very well, thank you. Good, that's what I'd like. People to chat and catch up in the cafe and it gives us a chance to talk and meet other people with aphasia. They have tea and coffee. Student run the cafe. The atmosphere is really warm and welcoming. People are always laughing and smiling. Frank is showing adult places to visit in the UK. Sue is practicing using the internet. Sally started coming in a few weeks ago. I love it. I love it. No, people is excellent. Excellent, excellent. People like me, a tumour, fine, yeah. in here. No, nothing. Yeah. Just hard. Yeah. Hard. Yeah. Better and better all the time. All the time. No, okay. Neil has been coming to the centre for several months. I could not speak when I came out. Yes. I'm, but the one thing was. I was determined that I've, if I could speak, I would go on to speak. And the question was, how could I do it? Mm. And I, it, deep down inside me, deep down there, I, I said, and I would walk at these things and gradually it would come back, yeah. you see. Fantastic. Fantastic, yes. When you think about coming here? I've come here because I love to come here. Mm. I, I love to come and even the, 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 those whose job it is, they're only 20 years older, 21, 22, and I'm so grateful because I, I learn so much from them. From the students. From the students. Yeah. They also talk to me about questions and I try to answer them. Yes, yeah. Yes. Well, you teach them a lot about your experience, which is invaluable for them to learn, really. <laughs> uh, you say that I, I'm, I, I'm just come just for the chat. I know. <laughs> <laughs> it, it is no more than that. I, I want to say so much. I really love the students here. Tim's wife, Kate, really appreciates the centre. It's good for his confidence to do something different without me. Susan. And enjoy it, yeah. And benefit from help with his reading while you're here. Mm, good. Yeah. yeah. It's good to do it. So. Yeah, and it's good to be, it's good to we see other people with aphasia as well and have a conversation with them without the partners being there because you find that if you're with people with aphasia and we're all with the partners that the people with aphasia don't speak and they tend to sort of merge into the background whereas when they're on their own together they'll all teach and make the conversation with each other which again is, is great for them and benefit for everybody. You, you can really feel at the centre that there's a, a real sort of buzz of enthusiasm um, from people, from students and people with aphasia who come here. They can work towards uh, goals that they've set that are really about um, changing their quality of life. The other thing that I enjoy experiencing is what the students get out of it and I can see them increasing their experience of working with people with aphasia understanding what aphasia means to people and increasing their independence and their ability to become independent practitioners which they'll be when they qualify.
it's worth its weight in gold.